honey. It's just our stuff getting repossessed. By these low-life, bottom-feeding, undereducated, unhygienic, slimy, no-neck, toxic, triple-chinned, oxygen-wasting, crude, gutless, foul-smelling, buck-tooth, corrupt, felonious, disgraceful, disease-ridden, bow-legged, yellow-bellied, backstabbing, ghoulish, vulgar, despicable, worm-headed, worthless stains! <laughs> I'm only doing my job! Why are you so mean? <laughs> I'm not cute. Bro, your sneeze was straight up adorable. Stop! I'm not cute! You think that was cute? Oh, come on, man! I'm not cute! I saved us! No, I saved you. And I you. No, you didn't. But I did. You almost got us killed, Gary. <laughs> then we're even. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny and Neil are really good friends. They're really good friends. Johnny and Neil. Johnny, what are you doing, Johnny? Uh, no, no, no. I punch you. Uh, Don't punch Johnny. He deserves a punch. I punch Johnny. Don't punch Johnny. Don't, Don't punch Johnny. I punch you. I like this. Punch you. All right, buddy. What could I do to make you happy? Name anything. Anything. Friggin' anything. Anything? I just said friggin' anything. Anything. Can you get me to the Lord Commander? Okay. Possibly. What do you want to do? I want to slit his throat and splash in his life juice. Oh, good lord, that's dark. Have you ever heard the sound of a rubber ball breaking a window? Uh-uh. Would you like to? You are lying, I never hit you! You are tearing me apart, Lisa! I'm gonna give it one more shot. <laughs> one more shot. Just like I'm giving one more shot to love. <laughs> <laughs> and this new quirky sitcom. Love or get the fuck out. Yeah. Uh... I want people to see my fearless smile and feel safe. And be the kind of hero everyone in the world looks up to. Just like you. Wow! What the f happened to you? I'm so edgy. My family's dead. Life is stupid. I'm edgy. Ooh, you're cute. I'm Sub Zero. Ooh. You know, you walk out the door, you see someone that you know, and they ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Yup. Oh, that's actually more like a 60-foot plant monster. <laughs> Jennifer <laughs> dumped me. <laughs> <laughs> that was your shortest, saddest story yet. <laughs> <laughs> Three words is all it takes to get the tears flowing, I'll oh tell you my. that. Two bros chilling in the hot tub, five feet apart cause they're not gay. The thing me and my sister really liked doing was hiding in those circular racks of clothes that they have set up in department stores. Being in the middle of one of those racks is such a surreal experience. I totally recommend it. But my mom didn't like it when we had fun, so she had to reach her arm in and try and grab us. Do you need any help? Oh no, I'm just trying to get something in the back. There's a really nice belt that would be great for spanking my misbehaving children! <laughs> This is awesome! We're gonna be best friends and do everything together and be the coolest guys ever and- Yeah, I'm not really looking for a commitment right now. I'm kind of just focusing on my career. Oh. Really? It's not you. It's me. Stay! Aurora Borealis! At this time of year, at this time of day, in this part of the country, localized entirely within your kitchen. Yes. May I see it? No. Seymour! The house is on fire! No, Mother, it's just the Northern Lights. If I were a drink, I'd be Cherry Vanilla Coke. If you were a drink, what would you be? Bleach. Sewage. Okay, Edgelords, calm down. Ah! What the? Dude! This is all messed up! I know, right? I mean, future me wearing sandals? I mean, you're gonna steal Carrie from me! It's supposed to be Car Win, not Car Ball! You and it looks like I didn't stop at women. Ah! <laughs> I agree. I always thought I was the one wearing the pants in this relationship. Are you sure you sure you sure you sure you sure you sure? Where's Toad when you need him? 
Toad, Homer's here. I got this. Yeah, hey, Toad, you have any donuts? No, this. Phrase you better learn for your adult years. Hey, buddy, got a quarter? <gasps> I am shocked and appalled. I was dumped in the past, so now no one else can love either. Yes, I too had an equally sane reaction to being dumped. We're so obviously mental stable people, this relationship can totally work. I know. I wanted to tell you for so long. Mom was Pink Diamond. Where was this earlier? It's a I don't know about you, but I am having a wonderful time here. You toppled a South American government, Carl! The people have spoken. Viva la resistance! You pushed the resistance leader into a giant fan! He was a traitor and a scoundrel. He was trying to stop you from pushing other people into a giant fan! You can let go now. I said let go, please. Why he touching my man? Where he going with my man? Uh, Carl! What on earth was all that? Uh, I'm not sure what you're referring to. You sunk an entire cruise ship, Carl! Are you sure that was me? I, I would think I would remember something like that. Carl, I watched you fire a harpoon into the captain's face! That sounds dangerous. You were headbutting children off the side of the ship! That, uh, that must have been horrifying to watch. And then you started making out with the ice sculptures! Well, thank God that the children weren't on board to see it. Ah, uh, Carl, why is the lifeboat all red and sticky? Well, I guess you could say it is red and sticky. Carl, what are we standing in? Would you believe it's strawberry milkshake? No, I would not believe that. Uh, melted gumdrops. No. Boat nectar. No. Some of God's tears. Tell me the truth, Carl. Fine. It's the lovely elderly couple from 2B. Carl! Well, they were, uh, they were taking all the crescent rolls. I can't believe what I'm hearing. I will not apologize for art. Where are the other lifeboats? Whoa, you won the prize. I didn't even notice that. Where are the other lifeboats, Carl? Looking at the trajectory of the moon and the sun, probably at the bottom of the ocean. I bit lots of holes in them. Carl! I have a problem. I have a serious problem. You are just terrible today. Shh! Do you hear that? That's the sound of forgiveness. That's the sound of people drowning, Carl. That is what forgiveness sounds like. Screaming and then silence. Would you rather be alone? I'm sorry. Wait. And with that, I'm fairly certain that we've exhausted every variation on that joke. Is there any other deal that you can accept? Three-way. Hmm. You, me, and March? Demon, demon, you. Ugh, I guess it's one of those things a dad has to do. Now, before we start, what's the safe word? Cinnamon. Ooh, I like that. Now, I'd like to try something new, if you don't mind. Ah, cinnamon. Cinnamon! 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 Marion. Oh, where did he go? Somebody won't tell me the world is gonna roll me. We're moving, we're beating Hacker at his game. Don't come in every time. I'm bored. I'm cured. Excuse me, is this room 106? Hey, who's that? I, I don't know. Why do birds suddenly appear every time you are near? Just like me, they long uh -oh. to be. Hey, would you like to go? Oh, she's mine! 
If you relate too much to Heather's, maybe call the police. <sighs> Finally, I can have my shake and go. <laughs> Sucker. Omae wa mou shindeiru. Nani? Although, if we're gonna do that, we should probably call me daddy, too. Ooh. I like that, daddy. <laughs> I, uh, I was just talking about Rachel. Who is Daddy getting angry? <laughs> is Daddy gonna spank me? Well, that depends. Have you been a bad girl? No, I can't. <laughs> Shut your mouth, you mediocre clarinet player. Mediocre? I'll be able to look back on this moment someday. I'm possibly telling this story to some kids in a car on the way to the hospital and be- Wait, wait, wait. Excuse me? Yeah, there's no way you fucking said that. Guys, be quiet. I'm on the edge of my seat. I had a bad day at work today. <laughs> Do you want me to make you macaroni? Oh my God. You know I don't like macaroni. Hey there, everyone. My name's Lion-O, and I'm the star of a new show called Thundercats Roar. Put an end to this. No, it's fine. I'm sorry, Cinderella, you can't go to the ball. But I love balls. Have a ball, Mr. Squidward. Dig a hole, Mr. Squidward! Take a stroll, Mr. Squidward! Score a goal, Mr. Squidward! Ow. Hey, so thanks for watching. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel. Um, have a nice day and I love you. Bye!